start our scarf. So the scarf is 65 inches long and it's about 10 inches wide. So let's start making it. I used a gray color and with the recommended crochet hook size of six, I finished all the yarn. I had um, a very old yarn and I, don't even, I didn't keep the labels. So I just used all the yarn, which made it 65 inches long. I usually make the scarf as wide as someone's uh, hand span. And uh, the length is usually the length of the wearer. So we'll start with a slip knot and then we'll chain 30 on a multiple of twos. So for this scarf, I chained 30. So every row will start with chain three. And here for the foundation row, into the fourth chain from the beginning or from your hook, we'll start with a single crochet. Then the next stitch will get a double crochet and then a single crochet. And then the next will be double crochet and we'll alternate single and double crochet till the end of the row. And we will end with a single crochet. And my last single crochet into that last chain. Now we'll turn and we'll chain three. So now each single crochet will get a double crochet on top and each double crochet will get a single crochet. And since we started with a double with a chain which counts as a double crochet the next stitch should be a single crochet and we can see that's on top of the double crochet from the previous row so here we'll have a single crochet the next stitch after the chain and then we'll have a double crochet which is on top of the single crochet from the previous row and then we'll have a single crochet and then a double crochet and then a single crochet again and it starts giving that texture that we are looking into that stitch and it just looks gorgeous. And then we have a double crochet and this row will repeat till the end of the length of our scarf. Once you reach the end, do not forget that last single crochet we have to do because this is actually the chain from the previous row. So make sure you go on top of it and do your single crochet there. So when you chain three and turn or turn in chain three, you have that stitch there. And then you continue with a single crochet after that chain and a double crochet. And this will keep your sides go straight and parallel to each other. Subscribe. Thank you all for watching. Subscribe.